at the moment in Toronto, where I'll be staying here for a couple of hours. And then the journey resumes, where I'll be headed off to Port of Spain, basically Trinidad and Tobago, where the journey is about approximately six and a half hours, and then we'll be waiting there about eight hours, and then with the final destination being Guyana, arriving on Sunday morning. Um, had a good flight, and I'm just going to show you guys Toronto Airport. It's quite nice. I'm okay now. On my way to Port of Spain, which is part of uh, Trinidad and Tobago. Uh, where the journey is going to be approximately seven and a half hours, eight hours. And then I'll be staying in the airport in Port of Spain for about eight hours. Where on Sunday morning I will be traveling to my final destination of Guyana. Touchdown to Port of Spain. Uh, time local time is around 10 past 10 pm. I'm going to stay here for 8 hours and then catch the last airplane to Guyana. Made a new friend, Archie. A bit dark. It's too dark anyway. <laughs> He's going to stay in Trinidad. Well, good luck, don't get kidnapped. <laughs> Do my best. Is he coming home? <laughs> it was, it was coming home. Yeah. Port of Spain's airport, as you can see, this is a chicken shop, okay? Inside the airport. But it's something that London lacks, and that is it has booze inside. Hello, mate. You want to come over here? You want to introduce yourself to London? Um, <laughs> <laughs> I'm Chris Denchard. I'm working at the Castle Bar at the airport. Okay, and how long have you been working here? For roughly about 10 months. Okay. Is it that do you get these odd customers where they want chicken with the booze? Is it, that does it get confusing? How does it work? I don't get confusing. All I'm going to do is um, take the cash or card or whatever they pay with me. Okay. That's awesome. So which one uh, on, on the menu, what do you recommend? Chicken. Chicken? For both? As a perfect combination, as a good menu. Um, okay. Chicken Okay. Better than some of That's wicked, man. Thank you, man. Cheers. Archie, sound good for you? Chicken sandwich it is. Alright then, mate. And I think we'll probably have a couple of carrots. That's it. In the... As you can see, the half Guyanese guy getting angry. <laughs> <laughs> and D man is driving. <laughs> see, this is a really quite quite a nice view we have of Guyana. Not everyone stabbing each other, as you can see. Clearly, it's not 9 p.m. yet. <laughs> Yo, what's up, man? You're good, Albert, yeah? Yeah, man, I'm right. <laughs> good, man. He's smiling, you see. He had, 
He has these nice beers and stuff. He's happy. He's happy. So let's interview uh, D-Man a little bit. So D-Man, how old are you? 25. You're 25? Okay. And you don't drive reckless. That's good to see. Yeah. Do you ever plan on coming to London to yeah, visit soon, your, soon. Dad, your granddad and uncle and stuff like that? Soon, soon. Probably soon. next year or so. Okay. London is calling, yeah? So what do you do in Guyana? Teach. You teach? I promote beer. Okay. That's awesome. Promote Corona. Okay, you're a promoter, you're a teacher. Okay. Show me the beers when you drive them. Yeah, you see, with the, you see, not just in London we get Corona extra. Yeah, uh, As you can see, I'll put the promoter's side chick. Let's go back to the wildlife. It's a messy world out here. What I'd like to mention for this day uh, so far is that my good friend Goody over here said in, the, in this country, in Guyana, you're walking and you get and hit you by a car. Right -hand side. The person who hits you with the car has to look after you financially and whilst you're staying at the hospital getting treatment. And also, if your condition can't be repaired and you won't be able to walk again, God forbid, from that any, happening to anyone, but if it was to happen, they have to maintain your health and your final situation for the rest of his or her life. Yeah. Can you confirm this for me, please, Guti? Yeah, that's it. Yeah, that's the way in Guyana today. Thank you, Guti. In my hand is an organic fruit punch. There you can, you can see Albert enjoying himself yeah. with it. And John too. He's attracted to it too, you know, it's the real deal. Real deal. Yeah, my man. Yeah, champo. Poor boy. This is? Yeah, this man. Yeah, but you want to feel like a, a, a nice one for my purpose as well. I like the one that you look at, the cup, right? There's a big there's one over there. There's a big one there. There's a big there. The, the white face one? Right? There's a big one. Them transfer have a talk to something. I don't know you do what you please If you was a snake then me So do what you please So do what you please It's recording So do what you please So do what you please So do what you please That's it, my boy.